Hello and welcome to our AFT Impulse 9 Quick Start Video Tutorial Series, Video 2. In this video, we are going to discuss the different items in the Fluid Properties group. This includes how to select different fluid libraries, how to change the viscosity model, how to enable variable fluid properties, and where to find the loss correction factors. Access the Fluid Properties group from Analysis Setup by clicking either the Analysis Setup button on the main toolbar, from the Analysis menu, or the Status Light in the lower right corner of the screen. Click the Fluid item in the Fluid Properties group to open the Fluid panel. The Fluid panel is where you specify the thermophysical properties of the fluid that you will be modeling. The default option is a user-specified fluid where the minimal required input for a transient simulation is simply density, dynamic viscosity, and bulk modulus, indicated by the blue highlighting. Vapor pressure is an optional yet recommended parameter for the purposes of pump NPSHA and cavitation calculations. The AFT standard fluid library contains 29 different fluids, all of which only require a temperature to be entered. Double-click a fluid to add it to the list. Next, specify a temperature within the valid range and Analysis Setup will calculate the density, dynamic viscosity, bulk modulus, and vapor pressure for you. You may change the units with the drop-down menus as desired. Apart from the AFT Standard Fluid Library, you can use the ASME Steam slash Water Library, which uses the ASME 1997 steam slash water tables for accurate water modeling. This is helpful when modeling high pressure water systems at high temperatures where the properties can be determined accordingly. Another fluid library option is the NIST RefProp Fluid Library. This fluid library provides access to highly accurate thermophysical properties for about 150 fluids from the National Institute of Standards and Technology's RefProp Fluid Database. You can also model mixtures on a mass or mole fraction basis where you specify the composition and AFT Impulse calculates the mixture properties for you. Finally, the Kempac Fluid Library is a thermophysical property database purchased separately and used with AFT Impulse. There are about 700 fluids available and, just like with the NIST RefProp library, you can also create mixtures. Below the fluid item in the Fluid Properties group is the Viscosity Model item, which opens the Viscosity Model panel. AFT Impulse uses the Newtonian Viscosity Model by default, but other non-Newtonian Viscosity models, such as Paper Stocks, Power Law, Bingham Plastic, Herschel Bulkley, and Homogeneous Scale-Up are available. With the Power Law, Bingham Plastic, or Herschel Bulkley non-Newtonian models, you can enter rheological data for shear rate and shear stress, and AFD Impulse will calculate the constants for you. Just enter the shear rate versus shear stress data into the table, followed by clicking Generate Curve Fit Now to calculate the constants. The next item in the Fluid Properties group opens the Variable Fluids panel. In this panel, the default constant fluid properties uses the same fluid properties for all pipes. The variable fluid properties option will still use the values from the fluid panel by default, but then you can change the fluid properties in individual pipes if desired. An example when the variable fluid properties option is useful is when multiple fluids exist in different pipes within the same model. Finally, the Laminar and Non-Newtonian Corrections panel allows you to adjust the correction factors applied for losses when the flow is laminar or the fluid is non-Newtonian. In summary, the Fluid Properties group in Analysis Setup provides a variety of different fluid libraries to choose from, the ability to specify the thermophysical properties of the fluids, change the viscosity model, enable variable fluids, and change the loss corrections. Thank you for watching, and feel free to refer to the other topics in our AFT Impulse 9 Quick Start Video Tutorial Series.